the boat. Now, I think I've made a big, big boo-boo. Yeah, because I've just made the the mattress. Let me just show you if you turn the camera in. Look at there it is. I cut it all out. I measured it all. I put a nice cover on it, nice bit of foam. But can I get it in the boat? I've got a feeling it's gonna to be too big to get in the boat. I was wondering whether I'd measured it right, to be honest with you, because me and tape measures, my tape measure elasticated once. Anyway, so we're now gonna try and get in the boat. Yeah, I know, John, you, out, yes, I sewed all the cover, done all the covering left on the sewing machine, but everybody was bored about me using a sewing machine, making the curtains that I made. They were bored. I, I found that an amazing achievement. Give me a lump of wood, a lump of metal, I'll pay to use a sewing machine. Well, it's virtually impossible. These women, they're amazing. How do they do it? Yeah, it's got a little bobbin underneath. Anyway, we won't talk about sewing machines. I'll, hopefully I'm finished with sewing machines from there. Anyway, I'm going to go and try and put this in the boat now. <laughs> Bit of laugh, isn't it? If it don't fit, start all over again, won't we? Anyway, let's... Uh... Right. All right, the first project is going to be to see if we can get it in this back bit. Yeah, let's have a look. Put the steps down. Let's have a look in there. Is it all, is it all clean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Will it get... <laughs> don't, don't laugh, all right? Oh, oh, oh. oh my God. I measured it. I must have met look at that. Right. Stage one done. Stage two next day. <laughs> Let's put you on pause. Now, I'll have a look at it. It's going to be tight, very tight. So, Let's have a look. Now, if there's some swearing, I will apologise. Right, the first thing I've got to do is get it in. If I get stuck in here, my phone's inside so I can phone for the RS, RNLP to rescue me from the boat. Anyway, let's give it a good old tug. Let's move it into that corner there. Then we'll... Oh dear. Ah, maybe that's the way to do it. Oh, I think I'm going to get it in. Yeah, it's going... Oh, you know, hang on. Hang on. It's in here. Hang on. Hey, hey, hey. Wow. It, it's in. Where's it going to go now? I've not wanted to be honest with you. Ah. Hang on. Uh, it's stuck. Oh, it, it, it. Oh. I don't know if I've measured this right. Good if I haven't. Let's get it. Oh, dear. Oh, we've got it nearly there now. Let's 
let's uh, close that. Right, I'm gonna, you're coming in here now to watch. Let's go. Now, would it fit? Let, let me put you there. Let's, what can you see? Possibly, I, 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 possibly, I, I should have had a tidy up first, shouldn't I? Right, all we got to do now is rotate it round that way and it should fit, if I've measured it with my elasticated tape measure. I, I tell you at some point, owning a boat. Right, here we go then. Let's bend it. Made out of foam, mate. Right? Oh, ho, ho, ho. hey, it's nearly there. It is nearly there. I tell you what, this guy's a genius. I I had no doubts whatsoever that this would fit. Hey, look at that. Ted, you're a genius. No, no, you don't need to agree with me, okay? Look at that. Hey. I ain't even got to order anything. It's a, it actually fits. Look at that, a beautiful mattress. Oh. Oh, let's uh, put this bit down here now. That goes round the the thingy. I'm gonna have to. I did do this with Velcro. The Velcro from the luggage. I'm gonna have to sew that Velcro on. It's uh, it's come off, but don't worry. We'll just put it there as a temporary measure, and then I'll come back with the thingy. Look at that! A big, big six inch memory foam mattress. I tell you what, this is a better mattress than what I've got at home. Look at that, and we got curtains as well now. Look at, I tell you what, I think I'll be able to take this down to Monte Carlo, the boat. I reckon it'd sit perfectly amongst all them millionaires' boats, wouldn't it? Yeah, look at that. It's in there, won't you? Can I, shall I test it, see how comfortable it is, shall we? Wow, look at that. It fits in there, a tree, and I measured it. So we go in that way, we put our feet down the back. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, oh. And when I've got company, they can come and right next to me. The only trouble is, we're not going to do much because we've got a bloody great pole in the middle. But never mind. And poles get everywhere, don't they? Masks, sorry. Masks. So what do you reckon? Do you reckon I should go? Absolutely not good. I might go to sleep now and have a rest, but look at that. I did it. Oh. Let me, I'm just going to try it out, okay? If nothing moves for the next 10 minutes, you know I've fallen asleep. Oh, oh, that is. Oh, oh. All I need now is a little quilt cover and then, and then, and then uh, that 
innocent to that. Look, I've got my window up there. I've got to do something about this. I've got a leak up here because I get pulled to death, so I'll have to put a plastic sheet down here. Anyway, what a successful morning we've had. Look at that, eh? Hey. Go. Well, there you go. What do you reckon? Hey? I think uh, I'm going to score myself eight out, eight and a half out of ten today. Yeah, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Anyway, this is a silly old bloody sailor, Ted. Signing off. <laughs> One of the most boringest sailing videos I think you're ever going to watch. But, You've got to do something in the wind, not you? Now, what, what we got planned? What we've got planned? Uh, we're middle of December, coming up to Chrissy. Is this the last visit to the boat before Christmas? Most probably. So, uh, I'm go I've got loads and loads of questions people have sent in. So, I will most probably do an at-home one, uh, answering people's questions. Things like, uh, where's Wales? Uh, next to sea? Uh, how much the harbour fees are, what it's all like around here, what's around the coast. Uh, do a bit more in-depth on the boat. What's in the boat, what's on the boat, what's not on the boat. Uh, must get a battery for the carbon monoxide to use my flaps because it keeps going beep, beep, which I, I think says it's got a flat battery. Uh, yeah, so, uh, you know, so we do a Q&A session over Christmas for you, just to keep you happy. Uh, if you've uh, been watching some of my old videos, I'm rehashing them with better audio because when I originally did them, the audio was crap. Okay, so I'm redoing them with better audio. So if you want to catch up, I'm about 10 months behind where I am now. I've got about another 30 videos to get through. So if you really are boring, bored, and you've got nothing to do and you want to watch a silly old fool make a fool of himself, by all means, uh, by all means, uh, have a look at them. <sighs> oh. Mind you, it's not very good for somebody with bad bones, is it? <laughs> these bones, these bones, these. <laughs> so there you go. What started as a, a little thought, let's make a V-birth and uh, let's uh, do that. It's worked out quite well in the end, isn't it? I am, I am mega pleased. I, I don't think anybody else will be. But I am mega pleased with the way it's gone because it uh, it means that uh, if I ever do come to stay in the boat overnight, I've got somewhere nice and every all the bedding can stay up there and all the other bit here because it's a very small boat. It's only 22 foot long, so space is off a premium. Yeah. Anyway, that's enough of chat, chit chat, chat. Uh, stay tuned. You, you will get a Q and A video soon coming up. Hopefully, you do that. Uh, next week up to Christmas. Uh, the wife's bought me something for the boat for Christmas. I wonder what it is. I'm, she won't tell me. And I've checked the Amazon and it's not on Amazon at all. And she orders everything off Amazon. So I went back through it and I can't find it. So I am totally mystified. But uh, no, my wife, she's put a lot of thought into it. Yeah. And it'd be bloody used. No, sorry, no. And it's something I've always wanted but could never justify paying for it. Yes. Yes, so I'm looking forward to that. What it is. Yeah. Anyway. Be good. Be happy. Don't forget. Be kind to the animals. They'll appreciate it. Especially over Christmas with this uh, this uh, Do you know what? Be kind to the animals. My wife. Do you know what the Amazon man bought yesterday? Right? We've got a bird table in the garden. These two dignity birds. Yeah. We have delivered by the Amazon man, yes, 25 kilos of peanuts. Well, these little blue tits and gold tits and, 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 and all, they'd be like bloody turkeys. Why oh, you never seen them? Peanuts. Don't. Anyway, as long as she's happy, that's most important. Goodbye.